What is up, people of the planet Osiris here with Osiris Game and doing another episode of Path of Exile Map Edition. Boys and girls, we are here with our first map in Tier 3. That's right, guys. We're going to be getting deep in the marshes today. Got an unidentified magic item here, which means we're going to be getting extra percentages for it being unidentified. That's right. If you guys didn't know, if you activate an unidentified map, it will give you extra quality on top of the item quality we're already getting from Xana, our homie who hooked us up in this hideout, y'all. Doesn't it look pretty sweet? I promise I don't come from the Midwest. That's not why I say y'all. It's just better than saying you guys, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, quick update here. We got two things. One, I apologize. You know why? Because the last couple of videos were accidentally using my really crappy webcams. Um recording instead of my awesome uh, desk mic recording that's you know worth like 14 times the value of it uh, so sorry for the low quality audio on the last couple of vids guys it's you know it's early in the game this is what happens to us new youtubers yo uh, it's all part of the learning process I told you it's character development guys look we just developed ourselves speaking of development guys we're over here in level 84 but that's not what's so crazy what is so crazy is what I just did to my DPS since last episode we got ourselves a five link guys it took me a bunch of fusings uh, I decided to finally go for it again since I failed miserably trying to get a six link a little bit a while uh, a little bit back uh, I went a little greedy on that didn't realize that it does take you know probably around like 1400 to get it all set up anyways uh, unless you're really like got the five link and I added my fifth gem which is elemental focus support so we did lose our ailments we can no longer freeze or slow people from our abilities but that doesn't matter guys you want to know why because I got over 22,000 DPS upgrade that's right 22,000 look my resting DPS is higher than like my DPS was when we last took off you want to know where we're at guys we're at 70,000 plus DPS we finally hit it I didn't think this character was gonna get to it guys but it did and it got to it real easily I haven't even gained the six link which I know is just gonna add just redonkulous amounts more DPS and now that we're here look at that 70,737 guys that's 777 look how lucky that is but yeah you know we're not freezing anything but stuff literally just bends over for us uh, I mean this is literally about as easy as it's going in the current maps that I'm at which I think I've up to myself to tier eight. Uh, that's where I'm at right now. Like, let's just go take the boss on right quick in the beginning here, and then we'll finish the completion of this map after the fact, guys. Uh, my little dude doesn't even die as much quite anymore because things die so quickly that I can just, you know, sit here. My life gain from my immense amounts of damage, even single target, it's just crazy, guys. We just got a nailed fist. I think I already have that, but what's more important is that two stone ring there and the graveyard map. Not gonna want to miss that. Um, we are pretty much at getting a full page, a full big page worth of uh, chaos cells, which is 10 sets if I'm correct. The uh, last time I counted, I believe it is 10 sets. Another map on the floor here. Um, chromo piece as well. Uh, anyways, so that's going to give us 20 chaos orbs. Since we have 10, you get two per uh, transaction that you do, assuming you do it properly. Uh, and we will be doing that on camera here probably in the next episode just to, to show you guys at least one of them Real quick because I do talk about it a lot in this series as it is the Pretty much most important part about mapping if you want to ever progress Properly you need to get the chaos orbs guys. It's it's just needed We're gonna be probably around the 70 chaos orbs I know I projected 60 a little while back, but I have found a few off camera that have uh, been giving me good fortune here lately guys regal orb on the ground even better than a chaos speaking of awesome currencies I've yet to use one and I only have like three or four of these guys and I know one of them was created by regal shards I believe so you know they're, they're pretty hard to come by um, and you can also do a vendor recipe to get yourself those but we're not going to get into that guys I don't want to confuse you if you're new to this game if you're not new to this game you already know what the recipe is you shouldn't even be asking um, now what some people were asking is what is my gem setups for my skills I did post it on a comment in my last uh, video about three or four videos back uh, so feel free to check that out I think I am gonna start posting it on like every video 
in the description or something from here on out just so that you guys don't have to ask me for that although i do enjoy the comments so comment below guys what you guys been up to how's your character going what kind of build you guys running just suggest me something obviously we're getting pretty end gamey here i might need a new build to you know start up if your build might be good enough for me uh i might you know run it and then go ahead and make a whole series about it so you know it could be worth it go ahead and link me your build if i think it seems interesting enough i'll go ahead and throw it uh, into a character and test it out um, So yeah, we're already almost here at completion. I didn't really follow my standard go around the corner I kind of got sidetracked talking to you guys after I defeat that boss so easily and things just die so quickly That running around is really easy It's just carefree. Obviously, we didn't get elemental reflect which still breaks this build guys It is the one thing elemental reflect does not work not once not never with the frost blades okay if you find a way around that which i'm pretty sure there's not you tell me and i will think about using it as long as it doesn't compromise too much of the initial build as well because look guys we're at 70 no well we don't have any of our charges right now but we're at 70,000 dps and we just completed this map in minutes minutes guys so you know that's pretty freaking awesome it's it's an awesome build i can't wait to continue doing this series because it really is just exhilarating seeing how easily this guy just chews through stuff um so yeah here's my awesome currency you know we don't really have all that much compared to a lot of people that play but we have been getting these uh quartographer sextants yeah you know that uh it's gonna be helping us out in the later game trying to get those maps that we don't have if you don't understand how to use those guys look up a different video because i don't have one on it to reference anyways that's it guys that was the map uh you know i don't even remember what we called marshes right yeah we got deep in the marshes tier one or tier three uh map number one of six as you did see there's a lot more going forward on these maps still collecting some of these upper tier ones for us guys this is osiris with osiris gaming and i will check in next time